So guys, you have been making chicken gizzard wrong your entire life. Well, this is how I make my chicken gizzard and you should definitely try this recipe because you're going to love it. Love, love, love it. Keep watching. guys how is it going everybody it's cookie with claudia here and on today's menu we have some chicken spicy chicken gizzard and it's so delicious mouth watering everything you can name it if you're new here a big welcome to you please take a moment to hit the subscribe button and trust me you're going to love every recipe i drop on here and to my returning subscribers you guys are the best for my ingredients i have some chicken gizzard perfectly washed with some vinegar and lemon it's so beautiful and fresh you can use any amount of chicken gizzard you want for the other ingredients we have some green onion bay leaves fresh thyme some garlics and right at the back there we have some onion and some red bell pepper in this little bowl, I have some black pepper and salt, chicken nor seasoning. You can use Maggi cubes or bouillon cubes. I have some chili flakes, adjust according to your taste. Some tomato paste, paprika and white pepper. Also, I will start off by chopping my green onion, the onions and the red bell pepper. In a hot pot, add some cooking oil. I'll just put in my bay leaves inside and I'll wait until my bay, my bay leaves turns a little bit brown. Then my chicken gizzard is going to come in. At this point, saute up and fry for about 2 to 5 minutes. Then the other ingredients will come in. I just put in the sliced bell pepper, garlic, thyme with the onion. So just keep stirring and stirring until perfectly combined. Then you can now bring in the rest of the ingredients later. So now I'm just stirring these so that they have a beautiful brown color. Just like this, this is just how I want it to be, that beautiful brownish color. And I will bring in the rest of the ingredients at this point. Now add some water, close the pot and let it cook for 10 minutes. It's just cooking for 10 minutes, a very short time. Chicken gizzard doesn't take a long time to cook. I know it has been partially cooked at this point because of all the sauteing and that. So let's just cover the pot and let it cook for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, it's looking so beautiful. The last thing to come in now is our green onion. At this point, turn off the heat. You're just garnishing with the green onion. Just there until everything has a beautiful, beautiful look. You see that onion inside? The flavor is amazing. Everything is looking good. My home is filled with a savory flavor guys this is one recipe that you should try i don't know if you eat chicken gizzard or not but if you have if you have never ever tried chicken gizzard trust me you should go for it it has like a crunchy taste should i say crunchy yes crunchy taste or <laughs> something like that so 
yeah now i will just transfer onto my serving dish it's looking so good beautiful from where i come from sometimes we always use it to pick to like to eat the chicken gizzard with and sometimes we eat the chicken gizzard while taking like alcohol so guys this is the end of the video thank you so much for watching i hope you now know how to make chicken gizzard to meet again in my next video bye for now and please stay safe